Welcome to my store. Okay, just got back from the wholesale. They got a few new different things. Now, Guppy, same old, same old. But these are neat. These are panther crabs. And apparently, according to the wholesaler, they may be the kind that can live underwater with guppies and they don't need to leave water. So I'm going to set them up in a tank and give them the option and see what they choose. Okay. These are rabbit snails. Not sure why. They don't hop. Like if you've seen the fighting kong, they at least jump. These days, they don't seem to hop. Maybe, I don't know. They're a live bearer apparently because these are their babies. Now these are, they have them on special this week, uh, assorted baby African cichlids. And how many do you think are in there? I stuck the net in the tank, I pulled it out, and I got exactly 50. And I even counted them to make sure the guy didn't just approximate and say 50. Turns out I actually did get exactly 50. So if you want, you can count them. Just freeze frame and uh, away you go. These are called panda barbs. I think they look a lot like a clown barb. Okay. A lot like it. Not quite, but uh, they're pretty. And then this is a dragon goby. Okay, they're a brackish water fish. And yeah, he looks like a dragon. And nice shiny scales there. And these are Astria Tecta algae snails. Apparently they don't like the water. Or either that or they're just trying to get away. And then the little baby eel gobies. And this is something I used to bring back from Florida all the time, but haven't been to Florida for a while. These are calico crabs. Sometimes called bashful crabs. So they hold their claws up in front of their face. But uh, they're a fairly friendly crab. <laughs> he was trying to get me there, but yeah, it didn't let him. And then we got some pink tipped anemones. A goodly selection. So, yeah, only two boxes today, but I needed the pink tips real bad, so I went out there, I didn't have much. Okay, so we're going to set up the, uh, over here, we'll set up a tank and we're running out of spaces to put tanks, so this one's just going to kind of sit here. Put the crabs in there. Put a little filter like that in it. I'll show you when I get it done.